1962, we may not have truly appreciated Glenbard West High School. But 50 years later, we all realize how fortunate we were to attend this high school and how privileged we were to live in the village of Glen Allen. I look forward to these reunions as an opportunity to take that magical stroll down memory lane. Uh, you know, even if it's only after five years, you, you, you know, you see some friends. Because I see this guy a couple, three times a year. Little uh, Billy Ristoff. Little Billy Ristoff, football player. Here I am. What does the <laughs> reunion mean to you? Well, it's love. Lots of love. What does Nancy say? True Nancy. It, it's <laughs> awesome for me because, I mean, I've been to three now, and these people are so nice. It doesn't matter if they know you or not. I've had a ball. Class of 62 is some of the best people. I'll, I'll go to their class reunions anytime. You can forget Donner's North.
wonderful time, particularly touring, because a whole group of us from 62 went back and they gave us the guide, and we had the time all through the old high school and seeing the auditorium and seeing the gym and seeing all the changes going on and uh, telling stories. <laughs> we tell a lot of stories about what happened in 62. Coming to a reunion, especially 50 years, brings a whole different texture to uh, what's going on. And uh, it's been fun seeing the variety of people that are here. Uh, Jim Unrath and I were talking last night. He, said, he looked around the room and said, you know, everybody is in good shape, body, mind, and spirit. And uh, and that's that's fun to see, even after 50 years. Uh, so we've really enjoyed the time here. And Sally, how about you? What's your impression? Well, we've been married 47 years, and I learned things about Glenn that I never knew before coming to this reunion. It was fun going on the tour through the high school and listening to all these men reminiscing and telling stories. I was looking forward to seeing everybody after, you know, 50 years and how they changed, and uh, it meant a lot to me because I had some really good friends in high school. seeing many of my high school friends that I haven't seen in 50 years because who knows when I'll see them again and renewing acquaintances and uh, sharing a lot of good stories. Well, uh, 50th reunion is a wonderful situation because we cannot believe it's been so many years since high school and so little has changed in my fellow classmates. We look very much like we did. If we just put the name tags on, that really helps. Uh, coming to this reunion gives me some insight as, as to the friends that Susan had long before I met her. 1962 was uh, the year she graduated. Uh, I got out a year later uh, up in Canada at the time. I met her probably 10 years later. and. Uh, I've been delighted to meet many of the people that uh, she used to hang out with. So it's been a good time so far. I'm looking forward to dinner and drinks with a lot more of her friends.
together with all these friends, especially people I went to Hubbard School with. It's been a real treasure, so we've appreciated this experience. And how about Hubby? What do you I think been about been it? meeting a lot of her old classmates. Wonderful people. <laughs> and it's too bad that Hawthorne's still not there. that I haven't seen in 45, 50 years.
again, Deacon Parent. Just wanted to say, seeing people I haven't seen in 50 years has been wonderful. Being from northern Idaho, 1,700 miles away, I've been dreaming of these reunions. Coming back, seeing the friends, and seeing those people I was a little shy around during the high school years. I'm not shy anymore. Coming to this event means to me a whole bunch of memories of what I did in school, what I have gone through since then, an examination of my life, and it feels good. I'm delighted to be here and I'm blessed. But the 50th year reunion is a major milestone in all of our lives, and so I didn't want to let this pass by without having the chance to come back and see friends that we haven't seen for many, many years. So I want to say hello to everybody and wish everybody good luck in the future, and we hope to see you back for our 60th. This reunion has been absolutely wonderful. It's great to reacquaint ourselves as friends and former classmates, kind of connect, close some, get some closure for some things, and to see Glen Ellen and the beauty of it and bring us all together another time. Um, I came with my husband Rick. It's the first time he's been back for a class reunion ever. I'm delighted that he could be here. I think he's enjoying it so much and I love meeting people that knew him when he was a kid. It's been great. Good work, Charlie and Don and everybody else. This was fantastic. What a turnout. What a great day. Can't wait for Augustinos. Thanks for doing it for us. Uh, I'm Jim Seaton, and, and I'm just really thrilled to be at this reunion. I'm just happy to see everybody after, sometimes after 25 years or 50 years, it's, it's great.
Miss Betty Boo. She didn't move at all. She's still over there and uh, didn't respond to us at all. So happy reunion, happy 50th, everybody. I love it seeing everybody and seeing everybody get together.